So this is Officer Jackson again with Macon Whip County Animal Welfare. Uh, received a complaint about a potential Jack Russell uh, roaming the street and uh, was given an address and I actually ended up two houses down at the wrong address and met with a wonderful owner who had a German Shepherd and a cat that had been playing with uh, the animal in this video and thought it was about to die and uh, somehow the animal made it into their house. Her German Shepherd and cat were playing with it and uh, was bitten by the cat. Um, these animals really can get infections really easily from cats because they are just so terrible. Uh, so I ended up taking the little guy off her hands. Um, she had it just sitting out in the front yard and it hadn't moved in about two hours. I got the animal, took him back to the shelter, called some of our wildlife rehabbers and rescues, and they told me what to do, and I've been doing it for a couple days now. It's day three, and uh, as you can see in the video, the little guy is actually doing really well. After uh, three treatments of antibiotics, he's already moving around. Still got four more days left of antibiotics before he can be released back into the wild, but hey, it's been fun animal welfare, we actually do care about everything. He's like... <laughs> Listen, she comes up and starts licking on him. They sleep together. He... Oh, my God. I have, like, the most ridiculous photos of, like, pets all piled up on top of each other. But the queen queen of the house is the 14-and-a-half-year-old cat. But he's so gentle with it.
Get you. You're doing so good. You're doing so good. You're doing so good. Okay. 